y'all and welcome back to my channel. So we are going to try something a little different and we're going to start reviewing a few resource slash texture packs. Now the first one we are going to do, we're going to crank it up with Chroma Hills and let's get to it. Okay, so what we're walking through is actually, as you can see, let me back up all the blocks in the game, it's actually a resource pack test world that I am currently working on. So once it's actually fully finished, I will actually release it to everyone. And while I'm talking y'all, I'm just, I love this texture pack. I, they even put detail to these. So let's see, let me grab one. Just look at that, that just, wow. So when you come down, you this little aisle, we can see a lot of, and look at that designs. Uh-uh. Brown stained glasses. What? I, y'all, I didn't even know that. Just learned that about this. I didn't know that when I was walking through here looking at it. I thought I picked one of my favorite items on this. Oh, I forgot to fix this over here. Sorry about that, that was ice. <laughs> but as we go through, look at the textures on the wood. I mean, it's just, I'm loving it. So the full blocks also, I like it. So it's just, I mean, this is a really nice texture pack. I mean, it looks fun. Amazing. I just love it honestly and with this with this texture I say texture pack resource pack whatever you want to call it this one's not adding sound so I want to call it a texture pack um, I mean it's just it has a nice look to it all the way down to the concrete powder even has a nice texture going with it so what I want to do, I'm going to actually jump to show you some floral and possibly some paintings because I got those hallways pretty much done in this texture pack or test world, resource pack, test world thingy I got going on. We're going to jump to those and I'll be right back. Okay, so for the floral, they got some nice 3D looking textures going on and wow, I just love that one. It's very nice textures going on with these flowers. Oh, the rose bush. Just love it. Love the mushrooms. Oh, I think of so many ideas to build with this texture pack just from the look that we got going on. So the uh, the trees is not much of a difference. Let me clear this so you can see the texture to the jungle wood. So the trees aren't much different from most uh, texture packs that you see. Um, it's very common looking texture pack that we have kind of going on to be honest with the tree trunks. But a lot of like the leaves like that's different and it stands out and I like it. Oh we got stuff growing everywhere. Like I said, this is still in the works of <laughs> being worked on. Still in the works. And you go to giant mushrooms, and of course, when you go into the nether, you have your chorus going on. And I want to switch, go right across the hallway actually, into the painting room. Because what they did with the paintings is just. It's amazing. Broke, I mean, look at this. I mean, it's pretty much what you would find in an RPG world, since that's what this is actually going with. And I just 
guys. But look at that. I just love it. It looks amazing. Wow. Look, even with the paintings, um, the one thing, as y'all do see these black, with 1.15, there's kind of a little mess up with um, the art, pretty much, in the painting. See, these blacks are supposed to be see-through. Uh, it's just, it doesn't pick up. Paintings are not transparent anymore once it hit 1.15, so that's why it looks like that. So, once that hopefully it's fixed just picture like this painting right here it would be a coat of arms hanging above a throne just that just that not the black and you know just like pretty much the rest of these so what i'm actually going to do now because as you can see i don't have much finished uh i do have our redstone room finished pretty much to a point which I do want to show you the rails. They are 3D and I just love them. Look at these. Oh my gosh, y'all. I love the rails. So that's pretty much all I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you one other thing though. Let's jump up here and we're going to put ourselves on the display and then we're going to open up our inventory and look this is what your inventory is going to look like so what you're going to be wearing is placed on these wooden slabs and i just love it then you have this pretty much the chroma hills rpg going right here i love it i do also want to show you in the back of your helmet also has ch i love that i love that you know how they added in that little signature in on their stuff and also when I get in this mode look at that red circle that goes over what you are pretty much highlighting what you're using I love it so 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 much so what we're gonna do now is I want to flip to some pretty much some cinematic shots hope you enjoyed pretty much what we had so far remember subscribe and like like it up if you really like um, pretty much what is going on so far and with my little resource pack test world like it up show me some love I'll have it available really really soon just as of right now it still has a lot to be worked on but I do as you can see have most of it taken care of so let's shoot over to those cinematic shots
So that is all for this little texture pack slash resource pack, whatever you want to call it, review. Now as I sit on my throne, I want y'all to know that the link to get check out Chroma Hills as it is amazing, amazing resource pack. Uh Amazing. Make sure to let the creators know how much you love it as much as I do in the comments Tell me if you like it if you're gonna use it if you want to make an RPG world out of it. Let me know Now that is all stay crafty